Hey everybody and welcome to another edition of Lane Side Reviews and on this episode we're going to be shooting for the stars with the new Storm Rocket. Alright guys, so welcome back. As always, I am the Bearded Beast, Rob Johnson, joined once again by Scoops Porter. And as we said, we're looking at the brand new rocket from Storm Bowling. Now, I myself didn't get to throw this ball, but Scoops did. So we're going to allow him to take us to a little tour of the ins and outs of the ball and what he thought of it. So Scoops, why don't you tell us about the core and the cover? Um, it features Storm's new booster core. And it's a medium RG, medium high flare core. And it's wrapped in the R2S uh, hybrid cover stock, which has been made famous by the High Road line. Okay, and um, now I know Storm kind of had an idea of where it fit into people's arsenals, but how do you feel it performed? Well, Storm recommends that it's great for transition when the lanes start to change around and everything. Um, I found it was a great benchmark ball. It was the first ball out of my bag all the time since I got it, and um, just lets me know where I have to go up, down, change lines. Just, it made me feel that I could read the lanes really well with it. Yeah, and um, now if I remember correctly, right off the bench, you threw a 920-something for four games? 953, actually. Oh, 950. Oh, I'm so, oh. Yeah. <laughs> oh, boy. And that actually was on the, the Athens. Um, the WTBA the, the Athens, Athens sports, sports shot. shot. Yes. And uh, uh, it was beautiful. I just... Got to sit in nice and great reaction. It was awesome. So, rather than listening to Scoops here talk about it, why don't we take it lane side with our three different kinds of bowlers and see how it's stacked up. Alright guys, so here we are with Wayne Porter, our low speed, low rev player. Uh, he's bowling on a Kegel Main Street oil pattern. And uh, we want to thank Storm for sending us these awesome shirts. Oh, the, yeah. They are super comfortable. They're very comfortable, yeah. Um, like Rob said in the intro, he didn't get to throw this ball. Um, so I'm going to do a lot of talking. Uh, Wayne. Uh, yeah, you heard that, guys. Yeah. He's actually going to do a lot of talking. Uh, uh, Wayne liked this ball. It's uh, very clean to the front, strong off the spot, didn't give up any head pin, for sure. Um, the booster core uh, definitely has a lot of pin action out of it. Um, now, it looks like it's creating some, some good roll angle for, for Wayne. Yeah, with the low, low revs, he's able to uh, get a nice motion on it. It's hooking. If you watch, it's it's got the nice subtle move to it. It's not super jumpy oh, a little bit farther out yeah Seems it's roll up good. yeah very uh very easy to play very um open it opens the lane up especially for somebody with a uh, lower revs now here is scoops playing it now this is your as you called it your benchmark ball yes um now for people that follow us religiously on um on youtube but don't follow us on facebook you need to because you're missing out some little tidbits of things that between our videos that you don't know like my 953 off the bench with this rob handed it to me after drilling it up and bam oh money um that was on a sports pattern so being able to play this on a house shot pulling it out of my bag knowing after that experience knowing what this ball is going to do where i have to move with it if i can throw it if i have to ball down it's it's very reliable um beautiful motion uh it's a great ball now do you feel this was was a, a lot more down lane motion for you or mid lane motion it it's down lane for sure it's um storm's typical motion it gets down clean uh very strong off the spot um great pin carry now here we have john fallis who is sitting in for myself as our high rev player yeah uh john likes this ball um it gets good motion, uh, gets to play it. 
and he close to his own shot. He has yeah. to play this a little bit deeper than, yeah. than what he usually does. Yeah. You can see he likes to play pretty firm up 10, a little bit out, maybe straight up 8, maybe 10, 8. Now you can see he's a little bit deeper. Um, yeah, that's that, that's that kind of, um, that Sean Rash kind of, uh, or um, Dan McClellan, the high rev players, players who play straighter. straight. Yeah. Um, he's with this, uh, this slightly different tilt than the rest of us have. It's gets a down lane clean and then right off the spot. You can see he's bumping it around. He's playing where I normally get to play, like 13 out to 6 7. Um, but he's not giving up anything. Great pin action. Boom. Great off the spot. All right, guys, that about wraps it up for another show. If you like what you saw this episode and want to find out more, don't forget to follow us on Facebook at Laneside Reviews. You can also follow us on Twitter at Laneside Reviews and subscribe to our YouTube channel. And don't forget to find us online at www.lanesidereviews.com. So until next time, guys, we'll see you Laneside. This program sponsored by Turbo Driven to Bowl for all the quad two inserts and switch grip interchangeable thumbs we use in all of our equipment. Dexter Bowling Shoes, the world's most advanced shoe, the SST8. Bowlerama Berry, for all the lanes we bowl on. For birthday parties and corporate events, call now. Still searching for that perfect fit? With no residue and easy removal, Real Bowler's Tape really is the Real Bowler's Choice. And Plantronics, rig, stereo headset and mixer, for streaming, gaming, and more. Play more, pause less.